All right, it's happening. Here it is. Okay, this here we is go. Episode one point five slash two. Our now legendary lost episode. Yeah, we don't have episode one. The first Too bad. Fifty six so, minutes. So hi everybody episode. for the first time because this is the first episode you're gonna see. We're an hour into the game. Uh, I'm on Chocobo. Uh, I'm about to go into this cave. We got some characters. You'll meet him. Okay, I'm going to try and recap what happened. Okay. Tara, a mysterious girl, uh-huh. was headed at the behest of a evil empire. Right, yeah. She went to a city named Narsh. She had like a, what do you call it, a, a, a slave, slave crown. A slave crown. Which will never be mentioned again no. as a technology in the game. But it's but a she sweet was, band name. She's a classic amnesiac. Where are you going? Go back I'm, to just, the cave. I'm just moving around <laughs> while we talk. <laughs> just doing some laps. She's a classic amnesiac. Uh, JRPG hero, and she was investigating with the two soldiers of the evil empire and Who Esper just died un- unceremoniously, and they were terrifyingly murdered out of existence by this Esper, which was in like a uh, steampunk mine shaft. Steampunk mine there shaft. There was a lightning tortoise. There was a lightning tortoise, and then uh, she passed out, and Locke, our second main character, came in and rescued her and he then brought her out of town to Edgar this uh, that's uh, me I'm Edgar hey he's a sexual <laughs> harasser uh, he's, accusations have been leveled he's suave him. with the ladies <laughs> is what he is ladies love him so the villain one of the villains Kefka came to burn down his castle to find the girl Tara. as far as we know he's I, he feels like the villain yeah like the quintessential like the last boss you're gonna fight at the end of the game do you, do you know I know you. Do I know? You haven't gone to the end of the I game, don't, right? Technically, I don't know. Right, rehashing what we said in the first episode, I've beaten this game probably half a dozen times over. I love it. One and of I've, my top ten of all time. I've played the opening a, few, a fair amount of times, but technically, I've never played it all the way through because I had a Sega Genesis, mm. not a SNES. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't apologize. I had the better system. Oof. Uh, we'll, recovery we'll Springs. We'll explore that on another episode. On all episodes. <laughs> My feelings. All episodes will have Completely a Completely to a the taste, contrary. A slight taste of it. Uh, okay. I'm going to try to steal from this little furry guy. Oh, yeah. I'm so going to get everybody confused here real quick. I'm not going to do magic. I'm just going to... I do love the noise blaster. Dread. Yeah, so... I need MP. What does that even they, mean? They escaped via Chocobo. Ooh. Or Chocobo, as I called them when I was young. Chocobo Bow. And uh, they're headed to South Figaro, the uh, kind of Edgar's kingdom town area. Yeah, he had a castle, and then uh, they it's tried summary. to burn it down, and then instead of being burnt down, it went under the sand and disappeared. And we're never going to see it again, probably. Doubtful. Should I just stop stealing? Doesn't, doesn't have anything. Have anything. Okay, whoops, I already I'm overdoing it. Finish him off. I'm overdoing it with the stealer. I do love the stealer. Though. I just feel like Edgar's doing all the heavy lifting here. He does for the first quarter of the game. Tara doesn't have she's got limited magic points, so I don't want to use him. But uh He's pretty liberal though. Yeah, I feel like you can use it a it bunch. Off. Yeah. yeah. Still can't run. Oh god. <laughs> That's right. This is so slow. We're close. You're gonna get the running shoes. R- really we would have only have played the twenty time. minutes of the game, but we can't run, so we played an hour of the game. This is true. What's her max hit points? Am I should I heal her? I think she's just lower than the other okay, two. Okay, that's at this what point. I thought. She's fine. Alright, it's over anyway. She's fine. Take that grubs. Grub worms. Okay, I got a pro tip. There you go. Gain a level. Nice. And antidote. Nice. That uh, means that I... Okay, I got a pro tip. Ready? Things. Don't open any chests in this uh, cave. None of them? No, don't open any. Oh, I was going to go search them out and open them. Nope. If you wait till the later portion of the game, all the contents of the chest change and become like great items. What? Just in this one dungeon. I don't know why. But in this one specific cave, because you pass through it a bunch of times. Sneakrits. Yeah, weird <sighs> JRPG thing. Yay. Fight after fight. So I think Lots go up the money. stairs behind you. Wait, these? What? To the left. Uh, 
Oh, no, I was wrong. No, no, okay, <laughs> leave that there. Like, it'll become like an elixir later. It'll be a tonic now. Does this it's game have, know. um... Uh... Uh, chests that are actually monsters and then attack you. It does. Because they do not like it. It does. I hate I don't that. know if it... I, I think there is one, like, Let's the mimic, it. as they're called. Uh, they definitely have the monster in a box. With an exclamation times. point? Yeah. Monster in a box! <laughs> monster in a box. <laughs> yeah. Well. Need MP. Why does it keep saying that? I think they're trying to cast spells that they can't. Because you confuse them so poorly. This is dumb. It's over though. Crossbow. He doesn't, he doesn't have, have anything. anything. All right, I'm done stealing. It's over. No more stealing. Hey, look at this guy. Hey, bunny. Ow! Don't got steal. real mad. <laughs> got real mad. Do they? Uh, it doesn't appear to be that way. I was gonna ask. Does the health? Go back to 100% no, when you, that God damn it, when you level up. Uh, no, it does not. Damn it. You don't get the, like, incentivized leveling uh, in, say, uh... Eight? What, what game does that? I think eight, eight, eight does, does that. Eight does that? Do that, do that really? Does seven do that? I think seven might. No, no. Yeah, seven kind of sticks to a lot of the formula. You gain that hit this points because right. you're naturally gaining hit points, but uh, and I believe in this game they do the same, where they cover the difference yeah. of what you gain. Oh, I gotta. All right, hold on. I feel like modern Western RPGs do that more so, like The Witcher, on, I which I will bring up every time. The Watcher. There's a couple things I need to do. First of all, one of these things. Second of all. I am going to uh, do this. Ooh. Yeah. Back Speaking row. of pro tips. Nope. <laughs> Up into the right. Climb it. Edgar, climb it. I do think uh, our legendary lost episode, half of it was you walking around Figaro Castle. Oh, God, that's right. <laughs> See? Uh, God, there's always this fucking barrier to entry in these games where they're like, all right, if you can get past this Byzantine, like... You gotta talk to the people. Opening like, get the, area. Get the flavor text of the game. Then you'll play one of the greatest stories ever told in video games. But first, you gotta figure out what room, one room in this damn castle has the person that you need to talk to. Edgar. Got into it. Uh, should I be curing these guys or using um, tonics? I, uh, I would just use her one? magic. Okay. Why not? Because, I mean, you're going to leave here. You're going to have a, you know, you can use a tent or a hotel or whatever. Ugh. And I, I don't think you'll go through all your magic because you're almost done already. Okay. Yeah, just heal, uh, heal lock. He's hurt. Ow. Meow, 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 meow. Seems, seems like you're decently leveled up. You're not uh, getting your ass kicked. This game's pretty forgiving. Feel like difficulty was, and then it gets real hard in the second half. <laughs> I was gonna like, say, I remember, really, really hard. I remember <laughs> friends grinding. At but I'm here. I know you will only have to grind for one hour towards the end of the game. Otherwise, if you just fight all the fights, are there like super cool ultimate weapons that I need to find? Oh, there's all sorts of stuff, and Has I know them. I know where they are. Is oh, it my. in this town right here? Uh, no, not at all. Oh, okay. There goes Shadow. Wait, come back. Okay, so you can get these sprint shoes here. Come back. Go in the door that he just walked by. But I need to talk to Shadow and talk to his doge. You'll find him. Boop, boop. Here I we like go. the dog, uh, the dog sample. Oh yeah. Boop, boop. <laughs> uh, sprint shoes. Uh, oh. There they are. What a slap in the face that it's literally the most expensive thing that you could buy in the entire game right now. There you go. Allows a person to sprint. Eat dicks. Does yeah. it allow a person to eat dicks? Um. All the dicks. Who should, uh... Does anyone even have relics on yet? So that, that's no. a relic. So it's a separate category. Dirk. So go to relic. And then I don't think anyone has. No. So two slots per person. No. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. What is the... At some point after this, we become... You know, we fragment off. This is true. Who should have it when we fragment off? Locke, do you think? Uh, I assume I, I feel like each of the three will need, will anyway. need a pair, yeah. Damn it all. Hey, old man. But I also think it unequips the other group, so you can share items. Mm -hmm. I think so. 
I've been uniformly wrong about remember, most things thus far. I just remember being annoyed that I had to buy those shoes many, many times. It's true. All right, That's go stay I'm at the inn. Saying. Oh, the inn? Yeah, go stay, get her MP back. Classic RPG stuff. Inn. Plus you get a nice little jingle. Wait, do I need to talk to this dude? Nah, okay. he just does a thing explaining spring shoes. No, I just meant, like, to get a room. Oh, here's the guy, guy in the room. Hey. Yeah. $80! No, that's fine. That's nothing. Jeez. All right, everybody split up. Love it. I think in four, everyone just walks into the same bed. Yeah, the way it should <laughs> be. Charlie Chocolate Factory style. No, 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 no. Wait. No. Okay. All right, go to the right. Wait, the right? Yeah. Let's go find Shadow. That makes no sense. Oh, wait, go in that room. <laughs> And never mind. I thought maybe there'd be a clock with an elixir. Hey. <laughs> I know you were asleep, but uh, I couldn't help but notice. This was a bed for two. Okay, bye. Edgar so lecherous. It doesn't matter who it is. Yeah, so I will hit on it. Get the music cue, Shadow. What about this duder? Okay. What about this lady? Mm-hmm. I love this music is like a uh, Sergio Leone western <laughs> kind of thing. Like the really big, broad. Uh, doo, doo. Wait, little girl. Get out of the way, old man. No, come back. <laughs> little girl. What are you doing? She's just pounding some beers. Our kids oh. are loving her. What do you think? <laughs> nice. She knows she's bad, but yeah. she does it anyway. Burf, burf. Here's Stand one of my back. favorite uh, weird weird translation. Yeah, yeah he's good. Okay, as discussed in the <laughs> lost episode, <laughs> I've guided Kevin towards my preferred display of the name, which is uh, the sh- sh- Shadow. Shada. Shada. Shada? Uh, Damn it! I can't even do my joke with a question mark. <laughs> oh, whoops! Hold on. Which I'm is. The character's canonical name, but uh, uh, not all uppercase. I don't know. He I slit his mama's throat for like... a nickel. That's the. There's such a weird yeah. translation thing to say. He did. Whatever. And that's Shadow. The dog eats strangers. I just want to hear the dog sample. Ugh. All right, bye. Give me that cider, yo. Oh, God damn it. His job is getting the old man cider. Wait, so do I have to follow this guy? Uh, No, I think he's for later in the game. I gotta get that old man some cider. I think you can just uh, yeah, get out of here. <laughs> uh, if you want to go buy any weapons or, or anything like that, I don't know if you need tonics or... <laughs> cider man. Cider man, cider man. Brings the cider. Right. Do, I f- uh, uh, do, do I need swords? Yeah, go see what, they, what we got here. Let's power up a little. Give me swords. Give me that big Not dirk. Him. I don't need a dirk. No. Uh, mithril knife for... I guess, yeah, maybe the mithril knife for Locke, because he does... Uh, knife blade. or blade? Your call. Does it matter? Thematically, I give him knives, because he's, uh, he's a rogue. And in D&D, he would carry more of a short blade. Yeah. It's weird that he uh, has the option. Well, wait a minute. So, okay, so maybe I'll get this. Give it to Ladyface, and then Ladyface will give her knife to Locke, and then I don't have to buy anything. Smart man. Okay, hold on. I like also that eventually in more modern games, they would let you equip stuff when you're still in the... From the shopkeeper. Shop menu. Well, even like contemporary games of this did it. They just didn't, uh, you know, for whatever reason... That's good. Breed. That's great. And then at least I can do L1 and R1. Yes, that is the best function of L1 and R1. Okay. Double Dirk. I don't Aww. think he, so. Lock. I don't think does shields. Uh, she has a buckler. They both got bucklers. Yeah, let's see if you can get a better shield. Then I don't think they offer one. Uh, if you go to the oh, right. Well, yeah, I gotta go to this guy. That's right. Dun, 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 dun. Come here. Buckler. Oh, I guess he can use shields. Okay, so you get one. You get a 
Check the sheep. Plume. Oh, I guess you should just get plume hats. Plume hats for everyone. Kung Fu suit. Yeah. All right, there you go. Uh, let's give her this. You're broke, bro. No way, bro. I can still you afford. You can sell all that stuff. Too. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Time to equip some biz. Let's just do that. It's funny, I don't think I've ever used Optimum once. Oh, yeah, that's I'm all about great. it. Just optimize that shit. I ain't got time. It's pretty great. I ain't got time. Okay, uh, how do I do this? Take my dirk. Uh, hairband, leather hat. Here, take my leather hat. Take leather my armor. leather armors times two. Hairband? Yeah, sell it. Gotcha. Done. Move on. Okay, bye. Whoa. Okay, town music in this game. Which way do I go? One to ten. Uh, I think you can just leave the the town now. Oh, cool. And then go go to where he just mentioned. Yeah. So the town music in this game, one to ten. This is it. This is the first of two. Uh, I mean, all the music in this is great. Yeah. Th this piece here is my absolute favorite. Terrace theme. <laughs> Slash Overworld. Overwatch. I mean, well, Overwatch. Overwatch. I did, Steal. I did meet an Overwatch Twitch streamer who has a $3,000 a month Patreon. Nice. Sure. I just played Overwatch for the first time, and I can't remember how long last night. Yeah, I fell I played, I one, fell I played one match, and I was like, eh. It's pretty fun. Right. I was never good at it. No. The best time playing it was with you and, uh, and Matt. Yeah. I gotta get multiplayer going on. Or multiplayer. With Michael Mazaki playing uh, the reverb guitar in the background. Yeah. Yeah, so this way? Go. Save it up. Save. Like so. You gotta get this controller, man. This is where it's at. You just press down and select. You don't have to reach over. It's nice. Walk all the way over to your SNES on the other side of the room. And... Okay. Uh... Okay. Save for realsies, too. Oh. Save for realsies. No, this is a nonce. This is an Iron Man run, as far as this game okay. knows. <laughs> Unless I need to use a tent, which I don't. Just keep in mind that if you die, uh, if you do the saves within the game, you keep your experience. Oh, that's right. But you're I'm save stating. Mm -mm. Just saying. Damn it. And this early in the game, levels mean a lot. These brawlers. Be brawlers. Okay, so different uh, different enemies, some new uh, some new enemy sprites here. These guys are okay. Weirdo, shirtless, uh, monk themed. Tonics. Wait, this way? Oh, no. You can open all the chests here. It's just that one That's place. In here, though. I think there's some good things. Uh, there's like a cool uh, uh, Dirk for, for lock here. Cool Dirk. Cool Dirk. Oh my god. See, that's why I hate stealing. It never works. I'm not into it. You get a thing later that ups your percentage uh, chance of stealing. Like an accessory? Yeah. Serpius. Is that what you'd call this thing? A Serpius? Cerberus. Thanks. Hey, I call it a Cerberus. An angry bird. There's nothing up here. Wait, this way? Yeah. Uh, oh, go down. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> That's going to go to that chest. So, random encounter rate, what do you think? Too much? Yes. Yeah. Definitely. Way too many. Way too many. There's some way to manipulate all that stuff. Uh, I especially in Final Fantasy VII. Yeah, I've seen. Uh, but well, seven has got the like uh, God mode, the four X time, which is the one that I like. I didn't I'm even not... mean like that. There's like ways of like you stop at certain points and you walk over certain lines, and it manipulates the uh, uh, oh the like random real, uh, encounter rates, uh, right. which is crazy. That's some but, hacker shit. Yeah, it's confusing. It's confusing. Can't do that. I do like that uh, quality of life stuff in Final 7, but the, the yeah. thing that I really wish that they had was, that. like, half as many encounters, double the experience. Yeah. Because that's the main thing in these games, is, like, 
I like the combat. Seven is really cool combat. But there's just too many fights. I guess it does become sort of a meditative thing, though. Yeah. Like, I listen to podcasts and play this game. That's why it's crazy that it was never on the DS. Like, it was on the Game Boy Advance, I yeah, want to say. Yeah, which I played that cart on my DS. Because uh. those first DSs, you could plug in the Game Boy Advance carts. Sweet. Open. Okay, I think that's a guardian. I want to say that's a sword for uh, for lock, or a dirk or what have you. Yeah, look at that. Oh, nice, good thing I didn't get that. That was really good. <laughs> I think. Okay. More stealing. He's gonna be a heavy hitter now. Pincer attack. Oh no, stealing. Brat. Woof. Woof, woof. Run. What is this thing even doing here? I don't know. It's Get out good. of the way. <laughs> it's just... God. Half an hour Terrible game walking design. around the castle in circles. That's true. At least That's we're not missing, walking the in missing circles episode. right now. Ouch. Balls. Okay. Mm, okay. Uh, I'm gonna do one of these. And I'm gonna use it on this guy. And let's see. Wait. I'm in pretty good shape. Get out of there. Oh, hey, there he wait. Sabin. Sh Shadow. Black Sabin! Black Sabin. Trilliums. Dem trills, yo. Dem trillies. Ow. So when you were playing these games growing up, were you like aware of like Squaresoft as a thing? Like did you seek out Like did you know the difference between like publisher and uh, like creator, I guess? No. Oh, should I have overshot this? No, no, I think, uh, yeah, here. I think the other one's a treasure. I don't. I could, I could probably say that they were one of the first companies that I recognized as a sure. company that was known for, uh, you know, producing or publishing certain specific things. Actually, before that was um, Sierra. Sure. Yep. Uh, Lucas Arts. I knew for me. Lucas Arts. Lucas yeah, Arts. I knew those. I knew what those games were going to be and that they were of a certain awesome quality, yeah. et cetera, et cetera. But, um, and then years later, like, you find out both those companies, it was just a few people making all that stuff. But I feel like at the time, Final Fantasy 3, let's call it 3, uh, was like an island unto itself. Like, I don't, I don't remember any, anybody talking about previous Final Fantasies. Uh, I guess it was on the Nintendo, but I don't remember anybody really talking about it. Uh, it was just, you know, synonymous with Dungeons & Dragons. I feel like this yeah. was, like, its own insanely, like, robust thing. Because there was yeah. just there was so much of it. And the, every other game up until that point was something that, like, feasibly, like a shinobi, you would get through it in one sitting. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, except like a, for like Zelda, a, a I guess. final fight. Uh, or a super R-type. Um... I was aware of it because I, Final Fantasy II, like actually four in, in uh, Redacted, uh, I'd played, and that was my first RPG, and was obsessed with it. And, and is this, that on the Nintendo? Just that the was on the Nintendo? that was on the Super Nintendo. Oh, it was on the so, Super Nintendo. So Final Fantasy OG was on Nintendo, and that is Final Fantasy one, both uh, English and so uh, even Japanese. two was on the Super Nintendo. Yeah, two two, which was actually four. Like, we didn't get no, two and three. That's why Yep. And this one, of course, is actually six. Um, Just skip in there. But like, we'll take every other one. Japan. I mean, you can have... You have too many. Their picks were pretty good. Five's wonderful, but not uh, as accessible. Uh, but... So I just knew them as two and three, and I loved two, and then I played every fucking RPG on the Super Nintendo, no matter how awful it was. Do uh, they have and a... tedious. Do they have a big glut of them? 
But yeah, I, I think that, like the RPG, the Super Nintendo and the PlayStation One. There, I saved it in just game. That, happy. Thank you, I appreciate it. Because um, you very well may, you very well may die. Uh, oh. Yeah, the, the great sort of like era of the JRPG was Super Nintendo PlayStation, kind of following the trajectory and popularity of the Final Fantasy series. You had all these like oddball, like you ever play Illusion of Gaia? No, there's a lot of like PlayStation oh, ones that I want to get. There's at. so many. Sweet Den. Sweet Den. Yeah. Sweet Den Two. I played those. They're great. I've not played any of those. They the things that annoy you about this are really gonna annoy you and Sweet Den because it's yeah. it's it's less streamlined. It's uh. It's more hardcore. I'm going to steal from this woolly mammoth. Oh, wait. No, I still have a trillion. Although, percent. the battles nice. in, in Suikoden are still like this, even though it's PlayStation. Uh, they're super brutal. Are they like big easy. scale battles as well, though? Yeah, they're great. They're like little strategy games, like mini strategy war games. Suikoden's great because it mashes up a bunch of genres and then tells a cool story. Specifically, Suikoden, too. I'm trying to get into strategy games. I hate, I hate them. I'm notorious for hating them. I Real like... Real-time strategy or otherwise. Sure. And, uh, I like StarCraft. StarCraft's pretty fun. I'm trying to get into XCOM. Not good at it. I'm trying to get into... Mario vs. Uh, Rabbits? Oh, yeah. I, uh, I, I've seen very little of that. It's very I'm fun. I'm actually... There's, some, there's something in the very, very back of my brain going to your place the other day uh, and playing the Switch, which is pretty much the first time I ever played, played it and got my hands on it. Oh, Mario Kart? Was, uh, just the Switch in general. Right. Uh, was... Uh, dangerous for me because I think in the back of my mind I want to get a Switch. It's very fun. Uh, there's just so many accessories and stuff that I would get <laughs> maybe with it that it would it's just it's deceptively expensive. Like a stand and uh, things like that. Well a case or whatever right. it is that the controllers I got a cheap case, stuff. that's great. Uh, but really oh well. shit which one right. um, but I'm trying to know as little as possible about Breath of the Wild, oh, Mario that's... Odyssey, uh, sure. I'm trying to just like not know too much about it in the event that maybe one day I'll have my own Switch. You should get it and get Breath of the Wild. And don't look anything up or know anything and just walk around. Yeah, it's like, that's, I mean, the, that's the joy of that I've game. Read and heard so much about that one in particular already. But, that's great. They just uh, set you down. I think, yeah, I think I might be into that game. There's some things that might. Uh, well, you like Skyrim a lot. That might right? irk me, yeah. Yeah, you. well, then you'd like But it. I should say this. I. Blast them. Blast them. I played through. Uh, Skyrim a little bit. I've never, you know, got anywhere approaching beating it. But I, it, I definitely like fell off and s stopped thinking about it. But then when they released it again for the PlayStation 4 with mods, sure, uh, that really did it for me. And now I'm you can fuck I, a werewolf. I just want I want mods on all these games on everything. I want to be able to just like kind of uh... dial in things like oh, if I'm not into carry weight stuff where like uh, you yeah. know I have to manage carry weight. You know what? I'm just gonna turn that off. I know. Can uh, we just carry weight in game should be <laughs> illegal. That was an easy uh, target for me. But fuck. you know, it's it's fun to even games like this. Uh, sure. Yeah. You can I, run from the beginning. I would love to be able to do some things like that. And I like. I really like. It's funny we're talking with. This won't matter to anybody but the two of us listening. Uh, but we're talking with John about game theory and stuff. That was, yeah. Uh, oh, we gotta, I, I'd love I, to get really, him on here to talk about yeah. that, actually. That'd be really... Uh -oh. oh, antidotes. Right. I'm poisoned. Uh, I really... Uh, yeah, I, like, I like mods in terms of game theory and how uh, you know you can play around with things and see how they break the game and make the game more or less fun. So like, right. I did like... The first time I got uh, the game, I did like a whole ton of mods and made myself invincible and all this stuff and overpowered and then I was like oh this isn't fun either right. I stopped playing it after a while so then I did another restart um, should I cure or I uh, yeah cure, cure everybody with uh, with her oh, or, or use tons either way as well. they're cheap they're a dime oh, a yeah. dozen actually keep her MP because you're you're about to do a boss fight. boss stuff yeah. Um, yeah the mod things are interesting because like in that community there's things that up a difficulty mm -hmm. other way other way no other way. Are you sure? Positive. What? This I hate this, this part. I hate this part because it's a combination of these the random fights uh -huh. <laughs> and this like <laughs> circular cinnamon bun of a fucking. <laughs> this is, I will say, the uh, the least inspired dungeon. So stupid. One of the least inspired dungeons in the game. This is like terrible grass texture. <laughs> I, I know. can't see anything. Like you're you're gonna be going to like <laughs> Zoso yeah, soon, yeah, which is like a cool thief town that's really well laid out and interesting. The fucking uh, the Esper Cave, which is memorable and has its own music. This, this is definitely way. one of the. Uh, 
It's Final Fantasy characters crossing a mountain. Yay. Okay. Let's... let's... Pretty good, actually. But... Wait, no. Go away. Yeah, I would say get, get, uh, get Breath of the Wild. It's really, really great. It's just a, a lovely, fun Skyrim-esque experience where you just you pick a direction and go. You can ignore the main quest, but get into fun little adventures. Oh yeah. Ow! Why didn't you jump on a wall and then jump on me? <laughs> and you knocked us out of each other. <laughs> I was doing just fine inside, Edgar. <laughs> Tropes. Uh oh. What? He looks so much cooler right. now. Boom. Get noise blasts. Get some bears attacking other Fight bears. Him. Fight him. Nope, didn't work. Didn't like work. Shit, did not work shit did not work trouble. That was a waste of a turn. Yeah, use fire for sure. Uh, crossbow them. This is like not a not a totally easy fight. You know, bio blast so that they, you know, I feel like you bio blast early so that they're getting hurt getting throughout the whole good. thing. Although I'm just presuming that it hits them. Oh uh, yeah, good. Okay. Yeah, you're doing fine. Uh, uh, I'd say heal everyone. Yeah. No, wrong one. Oh, oh no! <laughs> Gale cut. No! <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Oh, mother. All right. Potion time. Yeah, it works. Please, I'm somebody attack Tara. Tara. Get used to this. No! You did it. Yeah. That's great. Now you're in good shape. Stupid bear. And then this crossbow should kill him. And then Locke will hit him. Take that bear. Ow. Mm. Yeah, just fight him. Save it for you. I think this is a... Uh, something happens here now. Can I steal from him? Does something cool happen? Try it. Doesn't Give have me. anything. Oh, yeah, a tonic. Sweet Yay. tonic. <laughs> Bro, come on! What's the matter? Nothing. It just—it's—it's it's a fucking—it's not an active time battle. We'll have to wait a turn. Just relax. Aha! Aha! Uh, I'll give you the cure. Enough! Okay. All right. Off with you, you know. Off with you, Noel. He's a Canadian. Man. Whoa. Give it up, Vargas. I love this guy. Whoa. Where did you bounce in from? I love they, st they stand back to watch. Go over here. <laughs> it's like a movie. Clearly, this is between you two, and we're just going to let you guys... No. <sighs> Oh, that's right. That's who this guy is. Yeah, he's like the other pupil. Pretty, His superior technique. Pretty well-worn. Mortal attack. Blizzard Sorry. fist. That's so funny. Boo! Whoa! Yeah. Oh, yeah. I guess it becomes a one-on-one. -on -one. Heck, yeah. So, how are you with oh, Street I love, Fighter? I love this dynamic huh. uh, of being able to put in a... The Street Fighter moves? Uh, different inputs or whatever. Yeah. What is it though? Uh, so it's a Hadouken. Uh, is a good one. And you can can you do all of them? Um. I think he starts from with the three. from the get go. If you know if you know the commands or you, you only no. have three to start with, and then he at certain levels learns them. So like I think you're gonna have the. Um, but I did do that way early. Like the game is supposed to tell me to do. I don't know that, that it does. Input. I yeah, think it does. It does it? Okay, Eventually, yeah. it does. But you have like to in be, that battle, right? You have to get your life way down low, and he attacks you. Okay, times that's it. Yeah. To make it more dramatic. I guess I've always I, just uh, yeah. Uh, I like the I aura, aura bolt. That's my favorite, which is the Hadouken, like uh, down to forward. That one's good. Uh, the brothers are you reunited. He's just narrating the story a lot. Younger bro. So we actually met him in the first episode, the lost episode. Uh, he's introduced in a flashback. 
That's right, they're brothers, but only one of them can be king. Only one of them wanted to be king, I think. Yeah. That's a nice flashback that happens later. Optional flashback, which is interesting. Gotta go fight the Empire. I don't know. We should strike back at the Empire before the... Never mind. He's a bear. Double nod. Everybody nod. Duncan's dead. Duncan, no. <laughs> Duncan's not dead. Duncan can yeah, heal just, everybody all the time. You're running. Duncan is the ultimate grind character. Oh, yeah, if you, you just leave it. You know, you know that trick. And if you leave it on the everyone. river. Yeah, that's where I do the old grinding. On the river. It's on the river raft. You can leave it if you I do. I don't need to. I don't know. If you do the, uh, uh, where it, it remembers the cursor position, if you have like a, um, uh, auto tap a tap a tap a controller, mm -hmm. what the hell's the name of that? I can't think of the word. Um, auto tap a tap. Auto tap a tap a. If you leave it overnight and just have it circle and circle, you leave it next, overnight. No, literally, like that, that's like a thing, uh, on that's FAQs nice. and stuff. It'll, it'll get you nine, level 99 or whatever. I gotta do that. You should actually. I've never done it. On the next episode, yeah. you'll be like, Kevin, how come all of your it's characters' health <laughs> is so high? Well, I don't know. Just decimating everyone. Mm. And because I think because everyone scales up when they join your group, that they come in at the level relative to where you are at. Yeah, that's tough. So if you. Uh, but something, about, <laughs> something about these games, the Final Fantasy games, that I don't mind being completely overpowered. Um, this game especially. Sky Skyrim, like, it, it kind of broke the game for me, but, like, Final Fantasy VII. Well, this game's all I about... I like going through it without... Yeah. Yeah, Seven, you can really... I love this music every time. Wait, don't... This way. Ew! I prefer the Final Fantasy Seven acid flashback transition into the fighting sequence as opposed oh, yeah. to the, <laughs> the weird bouncy crash zoom especially that's on this the, one when it goes <laughs> and you're like what? especially the, the PC version of Final Fantasy 7 really uh, ups the psychedelia when you oh because it, it lasts like twice as long <laughs> yeah, and you're like so oh is this still loading because the, the port on the PS4 is the uh, the PC version which is interesting but I, I wasn't used to that uh, and this the, pol the polygonal sprites are, or the polygons are a little more sharp yeah, I like it. I was like, wait, like where's HD, my... HD, uh... but everything else is blurry. Yeah. <laughs> it's like the... Uh, there's grease on the monitor. Wait, do I go on that? Yeah. Yep. Uh, <laughs> we're going to meet up with the uh, the rebels of this game, this, the Star Wars analog. Because Final Fantasy has to be part Star Wars every time. Half Star Wars, half fantasy. Rightly so. Nice. There. I also like nice oh, touch I in this one. Kill everybody right now? Uh, like I think I think there's a there there's, there's a soon? there's a bed in here that you can use. All right. Okay. Um, I do like something different in this one, which I think started with four, is that the music of the overworld resumes where it was after the battle, versus you know where it was when you started the battle. So it doesn't start the song over. Does this game do that? I would, it does, I would yeah. Notice. I think for Final Fantasy II on the Super Nintendo was the first one to do that. Because the NES version is just... I remember that being a joke that, yeah, you just know the beginning. It's like Zelda. Like, you know the beginning of that fucking song. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Thank you for saving for real. Save it, but I'm not going to, like, use anything here. Yeah, there's a just a free bed that you can use here because they're your buddies. There he is. Bannon. Oh, that's right. Bannon, not Duncan. Yeah, Duncan. Not Duncan. I think they share a sprite. Bannon. <laughs> Check but out this girl we brought for you. Bananan. I love it. Kicks into the Narsh music, too, for him, which is interesting. Which I love. Yeah, this is like the, uh, this is like the sneaky, sneaky thief music. Mm -hmm. It's real good. And there's like a really piercing, awesome piano part that comes in. 
Here's their like uh Evils. Their mythology, their Game of Thrones y Bannon. Wait, that Bannon only had one end. There's that piano. I'm so sleepy. Just heal yourself. Your healing powers. Ooh! Tara's music. I love that intro. So sassy. It's so, uh... Oh, no, I'm walking slow again. Hey, can I borrow your drama. shoes, dude? Run to the coat. Mm-hmm. He's a more optimistic Han Solo. Let's be friends. Let's be the best friends ever. Wait, it's the same thing. You've seen the same thing. I got it. <laughs> Bye. Give me your shoes. Where? Where's y'all's bed? Or did I use it already? Nope. Uh, I think go down. Fine. You're going to get a really good relic here, too. Sabin. Ha 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 I love just the sprint shoes. If you didn't get them. Oh yeah, definitely get some of that. <sighs> I'd say buy a few may no. Buy buy uh how many tents do you have? Buy Two. one more tent. One more? That's so yeah. expensive. Buy uh buy a few potions. Potions? I know. Those are really expensive. Do a few of those. Your about, money's fine. Do like three. I gotta buy outfits. And then get... There's no... I don't think there's anyone selling that here. And then... Uh, oh, he doesn't sell Phoenix now. Interesting. Um, all right. Get out of here. Why am I shit? That's real nice. What the dirk? Take this dirk. Um, yeah. All right. Go down. There's a, yeah. Stay here. Free? Take a nap. Nice. Just Tara's, Tara's already slept for three days straight here. She's a she's an avid sleeper. Yeah, she's a napper. Um, right there's some uh, some items to grab, and then we'll go uh, here. Chamber in this chamber pot. Perhaps? Chamber pot. <laughs> I, I didn't. I it's supposed to be a chamber pot, right? I assume so. <sighs> I assume here, this one's left. a chamber pot over here. <gasps> green cherry. Green cherry. Nice. Just people shitting in Someone these Someone dropped a green cherry in this chamber pot. I'm <laughs> <laughs> stuck. Okay. Get out of the freaking way. I want that. Okay, cool. What's Edgar got to say? Is he going to hit on her? Nope. We're, we're nice. fair-minded. Showing, we're, uh, showing the we're the good guys. Sense. That's not a door. I just walked towards the wall. Uh, okay, bye. Where's Banyan? Okay, go to the left, go up. I think there's a couple items to grab, and then we'll go uh, we'll go talk to this poor guy with his goggles. Nothing in there. There we go, chests. Monster in a box. Oh yeah, Air Lancet, that's a good weapon. For a character that I don't know. You'll get him back soon. Oh, I these, thought it was these guys are dressed like uh, like 1920s uh, uh, biplane pilots. Yeah, biplanes exactly. Yeah, <laughs> 1920s <Prop> biplane. <laughs> <laughs> you fellas looking for a wing walker? Yeah. You gotta join us. Join the returners today. <laughs> this is gonna be all the fucking yeah. voices. Bannon, like he went outside a moment ago. <laughs> <laughs> so loud. Sorry. Oh my God. Anybody? News of the world! Oh my god. Oh, so wait, so say no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if you say no. What happens if I don't? If you say no, you get a way better weapon or better item. What? Yeah, you get the. Um, no. He's gonna give you the shitty one. Here, I have this piece of shit item. <laughs> That's Take it so with funny. You. No. He's gonna give you the gauntlet instead of the. Uh, <sighs> The other one, you can equip two weapons, and you give it to Sabin, and he has dual claws. What? I know. Should I restart it? It might be worth it. How far along? I feel like the just boring menu shit is what... Uh, it's okay. You live and learn. That's the deal. No, no takesy backsies, right? I hate you we have to live by our consequences. <laughs> I hate you. 
it's you. I was too busy doing the uh, news of the world. <laughs> damn it, damn Kevin. You, damn you, nineteen twenties. Damn you, nineteen twenties. There's well, trouble in Nosh. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> the whole purpose of me being here <laughs> was just <laughs> stupid bit. My grandma. It's all happening. It's sort of like plotting their machinations. Again. Of... Yeah, like they like prepping for battle. We need this this uh, sorceress. I'll do it if I can trade this gauntlet for something yeah. better. It's. <laughs> It's also, she's more reluctant. It fits into her character a lot more than her. Like, I'll do it. I'm beginning to sound like all of you. Damn it. Emergency, so bad. This guy's fine. He's not going to. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, boy. His goggles. And all the oh, goggle oh, brothers. Boy. He fell right onto his goggles. South Fig. I like that. It gives it, like, good war stakes. You feel the encroaching uh, empire. And it plays the empire music. Which is pretty rad. Someone has to sneak. Which one of you guys is good at sneaking? Is it the one with the noise blaster? <laughs> no, no, not the noise I'll blaster. I'll take my guy. noise blaster and I'll sneak into town. <laughs> you know, Edgar, get on the fucking raft, Edgar. <laughs> you lock Whoa, what's that? lock the even. thief. Uh, I guess I could do it. Grow up. Lete? Let? Leet, I think. Leet? Lete? Who the fuck knows? Do it. Dilly dally. No dilly dally. Dilly dally shilly shally. Yeah. Come on. Great stereo. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Great stereo sound. No. Hold on. Bam. Okay, now I'll do it. I love that you have to walk to the tile to make the... Uh... Don't leave the tile in. Oh, God, okay. this, is, this is the first death of the game. Yeah, this is the part where when you get to a certain loop, if you have a, uh, an, auto, an auto tappa tappa controller, you set it overnight uh, with Bannon constantly healing and everyone else like attacking and whatnot. And uh, you level up a ton. One ton. Health. <laughs> it's just called health. So good. Health. Blast. Wing. Did that even do any damage? It hit him, but it didn't say a number. I don't know, four. Oh. It's like some sort of weird... Bleeding damage? Mm -hmm. Is that a thing on this? Can you bleed? I don't think there's, there's, there's poison. There's a couple of different ones. Bleeding might be one. I don't think so, though. I like the blind because it makes it look like you're wearing cool sunglasses. It's true. Uh, <laughs> which Shiny one do I go? Uh, I have no idea. Straight? Let's try straight. You would. <laughs> I think that's it. This looks good. <sighs> oh, God. Whoa. You love the pummel. That's the only one I can use right now. No, you have Aura Bolt too. And you yeah. have the uh, the suplex. So Aura Bolt is like a Hadouken, like, like down to facing him in the button. And suplex is X, Y, down, up, A. I think. That sounds really confusing. I just confused myself. Nope, incorrect blitz input. It was a Hadouken. I think you can just push down towards A. I did. I don't know what to tell you. Try it again. Incorrect. <laughs> you know, stick with the one you know. I know how to pummel. He's got the cool hey! shades. Hey, <laughs> Edgar's looking great. Didn't seem to affect his crossbow at all. Nope. I'm just gonna leave it on him then. Yeah, who gives? Who cares? I think.
think that was the right way. Mm, or is it going to I feel like we're on? circling around. Well, no, 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 no. no. <laughs> Incorrect blitz input. I'm going to do it. I'm going to figure it out. You're doing that? Wait. No, I had been doing that, so I tried doing it the other way this time. It's, yeah, down. Down to towards. I was uh, visualizing it for Kevin. Horrible! <laughs> I did it! There you go. That's the one. Brat. Bannon gained a level. Good what thing a he's gonna stick worthless around. Worthless pile of shit. He's surely gonna stick around. Save point. We did it. This was good. You're halfway there. I love that sound. Bling. Got all the samples they recorded for this. Wonderful. Uh, Can we talk about Bannon's uh, his beard <laughs> character he design looks like on that? Mike Miller at his. He looks uh, completely <laughs> different from <laughs> what he's sprite at all. Yeah. He's like a crazy mountain man. Yeah, I don't like it. But he looks like a, a wizened wizard. Uh, I want to say left. Yeah, up is the loop around. This is the loop? Yeah. So you can go up forever. See? Came back around. <laughs> Let's try him again. <laughs> Why not? This is good. This is, uh, I'm surprised we haven't been attacked. There we go. This is hell. That's how we level up. Do our bolt again. Was this where you would grind? Yes. Oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah, that's the that's the trick spot. This would drive me insane, though. I hate grinding. It's inexcusable. I don't like grinding either. It drives me nuts. Like I can take the constant random encounters to a degree. There's a lot of games like that, and I have found actually that I am much more might be another reason to check out a Switch. I'm much more forgiving for grinding on a portable game sure. than I am one where I'm like sitting down. Because you're like on the bus or at the... Yeah, you're like, I'm, I'm literally using this to pass time because yeah. I can't well, do anything, the, the so I can grind and that's, you know, it's fine. The thing that the Switch has been great for me is like the laundromat. Just bringing Ooh. it, playing it, like a uh, girlfriend hangs out, she plays the Switch. Uh... I can uh, I can just you know do a few holes in Golf Story. <laughs> golf Story is so good. It never fails when I mention Golf Story. The person that I mention it to laughs. Yeah, it's just it's such a the random word. thing that like it is totally a, works. It's called Golf Story. Uh, I'm super jelly that it's not on uh, it's PlayStation. Really it's a Switch only. It's really good. Uh, it's it's also a kind of a JRPG. Yeah, it's yeah, it's yeah. basically that mixed with the like three a great three golf press <laughs> golf mechanic, like the NES golf mechanics. It's very fun, Wait, and it's legitimately are we just funny. Here? This is cave number two. Double cave. It looks surprisingly like cave number one. I don't like it. I, I don't like things that are similar. Double save you're doing. Mm -hmm. I don't like it either. You're not always gonna have double saves. Sometimes we're gonna save. Outside of the game, because they don't have a save point in like the game before close bosses. enough. Some, most, before bosses, they usually are good yeah. about having a save I point. I guess, that, yeah, that's true. This game is uh, very forgiving in that sense. But just in general. Whoops, whoa, whoops. Oh, something wrong with that blitz. Incorrect blitz input. Damn it. Damn it. News of the world. <laughs> Fight. Help. These guys are pretty classic uh, D and D Blitz. wyvern kind of things. Although they're called Peter Dons. <laughs> Terra Dons. <Terra -don. laughs> Peter Dons. Peter Dons. Peter Dons is a different, <laughs> a different type of enemy. Uh. Yay! All right, so you even got a level. You got a potion. You're ready for. Uh, Let's do kind it. Kind of an inordinately difficult uh, boss battle for the beginning of this. Yeah. I feel like this is the first really hard one. one. And a guy who will uh, plague you for the rest of the game. Sure. Okay. Oh, I thought this was him. But it's not. No. It's just Krabby and 
snail. I think they telegraphed yeah. him with a uh, some animation or something. Take that. Not a Lloyd. Good thing Bannon gained a level. Bannon. Okay, here we go. Yes. Ah! What? What is it? I imagine him screaming it at you. Durr. That is a great sprite. Durr. Just an insane red-eyed octopus Don't thing. Don't tease the octopus kids. That is yelling things about octopuses at you. All right, health it up. Now I'm gonna magi Burn with fire. All right, don't fuck these blitzes up. Blitz. Stakes have never been higher. Youch. No, not Sifu Soup. So the noise blaster does nothing on him, because he's a boss. Yeah, I think that's the way to go. Well done. Aura Bolt. It's a goodie. I did it. That's a good hit, too. Uh, Just odd, surrealist. Uh, who are you hitting? Hate that I know, the single so tentacle strong. is the worst. Like when he hits everybody, it's not as uh, powerful. But I'm pretty sure it cuts her that damage. Single tentacle. I, th I think the cut damage still applies with her in the back row to the tentacle. Like I think that's a physical attack. So at least it didn't just murder her. Yeah, that's why. I, yeah, I think she's good. Putting her in the back saved her. I should have put Bannon in the back too. I guess that's true. I didn't even think of that. He hates muscle heads. It's just like Who does the translation's so odd and surrealist and Ouchies. Oof. Health came at the right time. Yeah. Bling bling. Hit you with my fire with my cool sunglasses. She did such cool sunglasses. See food soup. soup. Go ahead. Incorrect. Ah, oh, mother. Is he gonna attack? I'm kind of waiting for him to attack before I do this health thing. I think it's going to be stuck in menu now. Yeah. No, Although that works out. This Perfect. is going to fuck you up. Yeah, that is fine. so damaging. Totally fine. You got this, though. I'm going to pummel. I can't tell. Our bolt makes me too nervous. Just do it. Stick with what you know. Yowch. See who's who. See who's who. Yes, blocked it. Great. Let's see the damage differential. Yeah, it's about 200 more if you can do Aura Ball. Goddamn. All right, I'm going to yeah. do Aura Ball. This next one. Just you wait. Ow, what are you even He's doing? He's just swinging. This guy is so goofy. That is the charm of these games, though, is like they they can be so serious. But hey, it. you did it. Well done. Yeah. Uh, but then they can just pivot to, like, here just becomes a goofy... This is my favorite music uh, cue in the game. <laughs> so good. Just like a uh, goofy slapstick now. This isn't Gao's theme, technically, is it? No, but it plays a lot for it, because Gao's... He's just such a <laughs> dumb, dummy. I'll tell you what. Uh, his bit with what's-his-name, though, is good. It is pretty good. Yeah, Mr. Like... Thou. Uh, <laughs> so I do stupid. like that. That's coming up. Uh, yeah, Gao, because like of the 14 characters, you only need to level up 12 of them. Whoa. Gao becomes the janitor of my airship. I just leave him behind. Oh, man. Yeah, it, it, honestly, it's his... It's annoying. The fact that he has so many different... Uh, skills that he can get from enemies is just like overwhelming. And I see like looking at like game facts and stuff that you can really you can OP him considerably. Yeah, he's crazy. Like, but I, I've get never the right had stuff. The, you can. I just don't have the patience at all. I know two tricks to this game in the end to make you able to kill Kefka like immediately. That's what I'm all about. <laughs> so here, there he goes. Uh, that is amazing animation. He's taking a nap. Uh, <laughs> So this is where the game just took off for me when I was ugh, playing it the first time. And yeah, I've like, never seen anything like, like this before this, in a game. Yeah, this to me is where the game just 
kicks in and gets focused and gets real good. Um, Guess what? Good stopping point. Perfect time. Organic. It's an hour. That's great. We're an hour into it. Uh, what an exciting next episode it'll be. Yeah, we're gonna we get to choose which uh, yep. which one of these guys we want to go with first, and then uh, we can do the the lock espionage one, the shockingly quick Terra one, and the oddly long Sabin one, which is <laughs> easily four times as long as the other two. Oh God! But All it's right. a, a weird odyssey. Well. Sweet. I can't wait. All uh, right. Uh, this was great. Do you have anything you want to uh, plug? Plug? Places uh, to find me? Yeah. Uh, you, you know. can just find me on the Gorgeous Nights uh, Instagram, Twitter, all the good stuff. That's where I do my music stuff with my buddies and uh, post weird, weird pictures. Uh, as we talked about last time, an account which is uh, added to by about half a dozen people none of which have any matching aesthetic <laughs> no, interests they don't communicate uh, <laughs> with each other at all about posts either it's always after the fact like why did you post this yep yep that's uh, exactly it uh, an, that's uh, uh, uh internal lengthy group text chain of anger uh, related to the instagram that's great uh, uh maybe i'll put a picture up of kevin's insane uh recording setup here yeah <laughs> uh, yeah uh, maybe, how about you uh where where, where can we it. find you i got nothing you got nothing no in fact i i earlier today uh was working on uh, removing myself from the internet uh you know you can google your name and see what what you find and it's i don't want to do that yeah exactly i it's did that by accident today and then i spent the rest of the day trying to delete myself off of the is internet. it just embarrassing youtubes from 2008 no it's just like <laughs> it's just like my home address oh, that's not and good and i was like oh you guys can just like Look me up and then come to my house. And stab me. Yeah. yeah. So I'm not into that. So, Please no stabbings. Yeah. So I'm not giving you guys any information. You're going to have to find me. Well, I'm Ted Buffa and I've uh, <laughs> meticulously stayed off the internet. Yeah. You did it uh, right. <laughs> I'm, I'm like all over the damn internet. I don't even know how to clean, it's clean just up this oil spill that is me on the internet. Mine's just, if you Google me, it's just embarrassing, pretentious stuff from when I was like 25 and YouTube yeah, was a thing. I have a lot of that too, and I, that's fine. I'm hoping to bury my uh, my home address <laughs> somewhere deep below all that stuff. But anyway, we'll come up with a, a, a name for this show and start pointing people towards this show and doing uh, yeah. social media we'll have for some that. And at that stuff point, and... I will have a thing to pitch. But right now, I don't. So that's it. All right, till next time. Okay, see you guys. Bye.